Hey y'all, welcome back to Everyday Mama. I'm Leanne, and today I'm going to share with you tips on how I keep the three zones of our family vehicle organized. The front seat, the back seat, otherwise known as the kid zone, and the trunk. Because let's face it, our vehicles are mobile living spaces for our family, whether it's the daily commute or holiday travel. Let me show you how we keep our car organized so that we can stay sane when we're riding together. Let's get started. The first zone is the front seat, the adult command center. I utilize the space in the door of the front seat with a file folder. Inside, I keep coupons for fast food restaurants so that when we're driving through, we have what we need and we can save some money. In the front part of the console, this is where I keep our diffuser. I found one that will plug into the USB port of our car and that enables us to keep our car smelling nice and everybody's mood balanced while we're traveling. In the middle console, this is where I keep the things we use the most. On the top shelf, I have things at the ready, pens, hand sanitizer, a phone cord, and I also have some wet wipes ready to go in case there's a spill. Underneath the wet wipes, I have one of those media holders that you get from the Dollar Tree. It's a soft pouch, but I use it to keep things that I don't use all the time in the car, but I need to have handy, such as a steering wheel cover and some first aid. This keeps it compact and keeps it together so it doesn't spill and roll around. It also makes it easier to find. We try to make the most out of our glove compartment space as possible. We use a plastic bag to hold toilet paper, Neosporin, and Band-Aids. That toilet paper can be used in case you have an emergency and have to stop, or in case you need tissues. It's got a dual function. I keep them in the plastic bags so that they don't get wet. We do the same with napkins and extra utensils we get from fast food restaurants. You will end up using those things so many more times than you think. We also have one of those small pouches from the Dollar Tree and we keep things in it such as a little first aid kit, we also have sunglasses, and a reflector strip. Having this in a small compact kit really helps to pull it out quickly, get what we need, be able to put it back, and again it doesn't roll around in the space. In the other side door we keep an umbrella and our car information binder. I have used this thing more times than I can count. I got this one inch binder from the Dollar Tree and it enables us to keep things such as our oil changes, anytime we've had car work done, and I love having it all in one place. The next zone is the back seat, AKA the kids zone. And we all know this is the one that can become the messiest, the quickest. It is so important to have a system that is organized and efficient in order to keep this from getting out of hand. So here's what we did. All right guys, so this is the Confacci box that came today. They were generous enough to send me one of their products so that I could give a review on it. And they were also generous enough to sponsor this video. One of the reasons I was so excited to try it was that it's a combo. You receive a trash can, which I'll talk about in a second, and the car organizer. Oh wow, that is some good quality. You can tell that's thick. It's got some great straps on it with those awesome strong latches there. Looks like they're adjustable, so that's good. This looks like it's about two feet long which is pretty good in size, and it has the bottom strap as well. Up here at the top, it's got a see-through pocket, which is good for your, your children's iPad or a small TV. And we've got some mesh pockets up here so you can see through, put a little animal stuffed in there or some water. And then we've got thicker pockets down here. It's like a different material, I love it. You could put a water bottle down here as well and there are some pen and pencil holders and even a small compartment. And then this is the part that I like the most. 
It's got a very big compartment here in the middle that will allow for maps or books or a whiteboard, whatever it is that you have in the car for your child. There's also spaces in here for snacks. All right, so let's move on to the trash can. So the trash can is such a neat addition to a car because I've been using a plastic bag. So this is even better. So if you look inside, it looks just like a lunch box. It's got that material in case a spill happens. It's leak proof, it has the Velcro latch over the top to keep it closed, and then has a little uh, latch here to be able to pull it forward. And I love the top, guys. It's like this rubber material. And so whenever you put your drink in, it keeps the smell in there and just makes it go down really easily. So that's a cool feature. And it has two ways that you can hook it. You can either do around the back of a seat with those same strong latches that we talked about for the organizer. But then it has this string with one of those push button holders. And this would enable it to go around the console in between your two front seats, which is what we did. And this allows it to sit on the floor so both the driver and the children in the back can easily access it. I really, really like this because it's gonna keep our car organized and keep the smells out. And I also have um, this really cool hook. So if you do decide to put it over the back of a seat, then you can hook this to the bottom of the seat. That way it doesn't flop around while you're driving because that would be annoying. So I really like that Confacci has really thought of every little detail, like the keeping it from flapping, having a little pull to be able to open up whenever you're ready to take it out and dump it. I mean, that's just, that's very thoughtful of them. And they said that they've used their customer's feedback to create these products, and I think they've done a great job. This trash can also comes with a liner for the bottom, and that will make it stay its shape it will hold its shape and its form better so it will sit like that and not squeeze together. So here's what it looks like in the back seat. And I have to tell you, it has been so wonderful in practice. To enable my child to have everything at the ready for himself, his books, his whiteboard, for him to be able to grab a pencil or a pen and have it exactly where he needs it. There are mesh pockets to hold his stuffed animals. He's got a see-through pocket where he can watch movies through his iPad. It's such a great feature. I love that there are spaces to keep water and snacks for long trips. And as you can see, this kid approves. Thanks, Confachi. Their awesome trash can makes it easy to keep the garbage off of our floor. From the front seat or the back seat, there's easy access and it's lined so it makes this mama happy that it's not gonna leak. The last zone is the trunk, and this is where most families like us keep a lot of things that we might need someday. Keeping it well organized is the key to finding what you need when you need it. In the visible part of our trunk, you only see a laundry basket. In the laundry basket is what my son and I have called a bag of hope. We went to the Dollar Tree and we made up three bags full of supplies to be able to give out to someone who is in need. Maybe they are homeless or they're down on their luck and it enables us to give back to the community whenever we see the need. In the leftover space, we store our reusable grocery bags. Underneath the floor of our trunk, we have built-in compartments. Here we organize things that we might need someday. We have some extra clothes. We have an air pump if our tire goes flat. We have some padding for our seat belts if needed. And we have a roadside kit with first aid from AAA. We also have a sun visor. We also store in here an all weather blanket. This has many functions. We're able to unzip it and then it can go on the floor of your trunk so that you can keep messes off your trunk, you can keep wet things off your trunk, and also in an emergency if you were caught somewhere you would have a blanket to sleep on or sleep under. 
Speaking of getting caught somewhere, we also have some supplies to help us survive if we were to get stuck. Along with toilet paper, we have some basic emergency food items, such as sugar items to keep our blood sugar up. We have some water, one for each person. We also have food that can last a while in the car. Every six months, I rotate this food out and get new supplies. It's better to be prepared and not need it than the other way around. If your vehicle doesn't come with compartments underneath the floorboard, you can take the basic laundry basket and take some cardboard pieces and just make dividers in that laundry basket and be able to put those same items in in an organized fashion. I hope you have found my organizational tips for the three zones of your vehicle to be helpful. I will have the purchase link for the Confachi organizer and trash can combo in my description box below. Check them out, it's a really great product. I would also love it if you would comment below and let me know if you have any tips or tricks on how to keep a car organized. Until next time, wishing you and your family lots of simplicity, progress, and joy. Bye.